Hello friends, I'm Louie Louie and today I'll talk about a new release, a very special release in my opinion. One more time with Feeling by Nick Cave and the Bad Seeds. Uh, this Blu-ray documents the recording of the excellent Skeleton Tree album uh, released last year. In my opinion, one of the best albums released in 2016. Along with, of course, Black Star by David Bowie, Post Pop Depression by Iggy Pop, and You Want It Darker by Leonard Cohen. Uh, and the most curious thing is that all of these albums have something in common. All of them are heavy albums and talk a lot about death and pharaohs. Uh, when Nick Cave was recording Skeleton Tree, he lost his son. The album took 18 months to be recorded and during the studio sessions, his 15-year-old son, Arthur, died uh, after falling off a cliff. A very, very, very tragic death. And the album is like an answer to that tragedy. Uh, the production is so minimalist and you can feel the dark feeling coming from Nick Cave. The album features electronic experimentations, ambient music, something very raw, uh, lots of synthesizers, uh, dissonant music and avant-garde spirits to sum up. Uh, on some songs you have the feeling that Nick Cave is reading the lyrics over the ambient music. Uh, and the album produced by Warren Ellis was very well received by the press. In fact, Nick Cave uh, transformed the loss of his son into a masterpiece. The Metacritic site, uh, which puts together the most important press reviews, uh, graded the album at 95 points out of a total of 100. This score is very, very rare. Uh, by way of comparison, Post Pop Depression by Iggy Pop scored 79 points, Black Star by David Bowie 87 points, and You Want It Darker by Leonard Cohen 92 points. Uh, and Nick Cave has always explored depressive lyrics, something a bit gothic, gothic uh, since the beginning of his career. But I think in Skeleton Tree, he took this vibe to the extreme. To notice that, I think that a uh, quick listen to the first track, Jesus Alone is Enough, uh, he sings, You fell from the sky, a crash landed in a field. A curiosity about this song, its lyrics were written before the death of his son. It's something very... Uh, prophetic and his fragile voice exposes his grief. It's heart touching and by listening to the song you can catch a glimpse of our finitude, uh, how we are small in the world. Uh, one second before everything was okay but now at the drop of a hat something changed and some things will never be the same. Uh, another great track is Girl in Amber, a very sad song with a very sad piano melody. Uh, he sings, I used to think that when you died, you kind of wandered the world. In a slumber, till you crumbled, were absorbed into the earth. Well, I don't think that anymore the phone it rings no more. He continues, I knew the world, I knew the world, it would stop spinning now since you've been gone. And he finishes up singing, Don't Touch Me. Uh, interesting, a very dissonant sounding song is one of my favorites also. It reminds me of Horse Latitude, the song by the Doors, with a raging vocal and a serial percussion like the piano. Something a bit jazzy, Nick Cave sings, all the things we love, we love. We love, we lose. I Need You follows the same style with a gloomy vocal and heavy synthesizers. Uh, he sings, nothing really matters. Nothing really matters when the one you love is gone. You are still in me, baby. I need you. Uh, in my heart, I need you. In all, a very painful 
mournful, hunting, devastating, intense, honest, human, visceral, heartbreaking album. Only great artists can record an album like this, a great artist like Nick Cave, by the way. Uh, recently, this DVD, Blu-ray, uh, was released one more time with feeling. Uh, it shows the recording process of Skeleton Tree and was directed by Andrew Dominic. Like the album, the Blu-ray was much praised by the press. I have also liked it very much. It was filmed in black and white and I think it's a very worth document about the Skeleton Trees studio sessions, but most importantly about Nick Cave's life uh, on the Blu-ray or DVD. He also sings all the album's songs on the video and I highly recommend it. And that's it. I wanted to talk about this new release, about Skeleton Tree also. And what about you? Did you like uh, Skeleton Tree? Do you think it's the best Nick Cave album? And have you ever watched the One More Time with Feeling DVD or Blu-ray? Please leave your comments and see you soon. Bye-bye.